works like you would take a bite and then I ask a question. That's what they do. Oh yeah, Sarah and I came, Sarah came up with these questions. Did you? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Vanilla fruit. Yep. This is the classic. Okay, so your first question is, what is your favorite book and why? Stella Duckett. Hmm. What's that, baby? Um, I got a draft. Favorite book. Yeah. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Hmm. I would say. I would say favorite book. Maybe like Dune or something like that. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. I read a lot of those. They're just fun. I don't know. Like the sci-fi bit? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I've never read Dune. Have you read Dune? Uh, I read it on time. Cody read it very long time ago. Who is that? We'll find out. And I wish it said the Scoville units, but it doesn't. That one's not very high. I, I like no. it. It's good. It's like a, I don't know, it's not like a vinegary hot sauce, which is nice because I don't, like Fra Frank's has never been my favorite just because I don't care for the, Why are they all not facing you? well, because I figured then I knew what they were. Hmm. Yeah, all right. I never like Frank's either. I don't so. either. It's icky. All right, what's the next one called? You can't just dive in, bro. Oh, next one's the garlic and pepperoncini. Ooh, I know Brian was excited about that one. Mm. Very. Moose, good dog. Hey. Okay, your next question is, what's the best Halloween costume you've ever worn? A witch? Um, no, but <laughs> Grammy and Papa, when he was little, Wrapped him up in toilet paper one time, and he trick or treated around the mall as a mummy. <laughs> I didn't know that. That's You're awesome. Low budget, low budget costume. <gasps> yeah. <laughs> you know what, this one, this one was made in Harlem. Mm-hmm. Ooh, how is it, Brian? Right? It's really good. Garlic, pepper That one, that one, and the uh, hot and spicy. The pineapple habanero that Cody got me. I've almost gone through the whole pineapple you know, habanero one. Do you need to go potty? Mm hmm. Okay. Can I get better lighting? Can I do this? All right, what's the next one called? Very far Barbados style. <laughs> Monks? Marks? Monk? Yeah, Marks. Marks. Monks? Marks. Barbados style. You okay? Sorry. No. All right. Your next question is: If you could change your name, what would it be? Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Mm. Hmm. That's a tough one. That's the first one that like has any kick to it. <laughs> Which one's that one now? It's the Marks Barbados style hot sauce. <laughs> it it's out of Montreal. It doesn't say what's in it. Hmm. Not sure what I would change my name to. That's a I don't know, maybe something. Just strange. Oh. I'm not sure. Go like that. That's just, that's just like, a, it's not something that I've ever, yeah, I've ever thought of. What about frat man? <laughs> Princess, Princess Consuela. I'm sorry. Yeah. Okay. 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 Hot sauce number four is Devil's Blend Hellfire Hot Sauce Roasted Reaper. That sounds hot. Someone just tooted. It was me. <laughs> this one was made in Wisconsin. All right. Question number four is what's That's one good. thing about you that surprises people? Um, depends on which people you're referring to. New people that have never met you before. 
Um, usually the like swimming stuff, just because I stopped swimming so long ago that most people don't think of me as a swimmer person. Hmm. You know dad swam in high school? Mm-hmm. You did? Oh. <laughs> this is fire roasted jalapeno pepper mash and tomatillos and a habanero. Is it spicy? Um, no, not really. It tastes really good. I actually think that the marks, like initially, is spicier. Like mm -hmm. this one's starting to creep up, but the marks was like spicy right off the bat. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What's been your favorite so far? Um, I like the Hellfire. I've actually liked all of them. Like those, all four. The first four I would eat regularly on mm -hmm. different things. Okay, we're on number five. This one is Los Calientes hot, or this is the hot ones one mm -hmm. that everyone really likes. I like the, we had the, the Verde one in our lineup. Oh, uh-huh. Okay, question five mm -hmm. was who, or which of your teachers made the biggest impact on your life? Hmm. Maybe Mr. Schmidt? That was, a, that's what I thought. Just cause he was the one that kind of got me the first interview at the lab. Oh, okay. So he was like, we can make some good things. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And his wife in middle school got me into the brass oh, program. Into the, the brass program? Brass. <laughs> brass. It's the labs, <laughs> it's the labs after school outreach gotcha. um, yeah. program. Yeah, these are good so far. Are they? Mm -hmm. Is that one the best? A lot of people like that one. Um, it's good. I don't know that I'd say it's the best. It's the most. Um, uh oh, she got a tooth. It's the most like pepper flavored. Mm. Like the other ones have had other kind of flavors with them. That one's first one. Yeah, this one is a uh, oh, yeah. uh, red jalapeno habanero. Apricots. <clears throat> okay, number six <clears throat> is... No. Tears of the Sun. Oh, the sun. Yep. Tears of the Sun. High River Sauces, Tears of the Sun, Caribbean Style Ghost Pepper Sauce. Ooh, ghost pepper. I can't turn it on, Dad. Okay, and question five, a six is, what does success mean to you? So, this one actually I have an answer for just because it gets asked a lot. Um, like, my goal has always been to like leave an impact. So, do something in the field that like sticks around after I retire or something like that. Okay, yeah, yeah. So, something that's, yeah, bigger than yourself. Mm hmm. That makes sense. Okay, there you go. That one's alright. That one's not my my favorite. Hmm. Definitely gets hotter as it <laughs> as it sits, but <clears throat> the initial flavor is just not. Are you getting the sweat on your brow yet? Not, not yet. yet. Uh -uh. My my tongue is spicy, <laughs> but not. <laughs> it's not awful. Okay, seven is. Uh, <clears throat> Torchbearer sauces, honey badger, honey mustard. Ooh. It says accidentally healthy, intentionally delicious. This one, this one worried me a little bit when I was coating them because it was so thick. It's really out of the thin. bottle. Oh. Yeah, it was. No it was real no. thick. Not right now. My lips on the camera look very red. Not right now. <laughs> you can see it, yeah. I feel like our last dab for us is very thin. See, our last dab's really thin. Yeah. Okay, so question seven is always the deep dive into social media. So, explain this picture. <laughs> I don't know where your camera is. It's this one. That one. This one. Oh, that was... <laughs> 
I don't remember whose party it was. It was one of Sam or those guys' friends' birthday party, and there were balloons, and so I put <laughs> balloons in my shirt. Look at Daddy. Simple as that. <laughs> Simple as that. Why not? Wow. Is that one spicy? That one's. <clears throat> <laughs> 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 Alright, going for the milk. Going for the milk. That one's. <laughs> 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 that one's <laughs> that one's yeah, that. <clears throat> it tastes good. It's just. Whew. That one. That was the first one that was like, oh boy, spicy. Yeah, I think mean, so too. The tears are coming. Uh, ah, Jebediah! <laughs> ah. Your dad's silly. Whew. You think you could eat it? Whew. We may, uh, we may not be into <laughs> single bite territory. Yeah. No more eating the whole wing. Yeah. There's some sweat Ooh. going on. <laughs> that was this one. What, yeah, what was the name of that? The honey badger honey mustard. It's gluten free. It's so, gluten -free. you know. Yeah. If you got those. Spicy, the whole Daddy, I need help. No, Dad can't help her. Game. Let me see. Whew. I'm gonna find a map This next one is the one that <sighs> I'm worried about. Which one is it? It's the bomb. Okay, hold on. But yeah, let me get the memory. It's the going. new one. Yeah. It's the bomb evolution. You'll have to try the original when you come out in July. We still have a ton of it. There you go. It uh, it says they redid the formula, and it's probably because of hot ones, to yeah. add flavor. Okay, so it's. Yeah. Well, this one did not smell good. De bomb evolution. It says <clears throat> this sauce is extremely hot. Consume one drop at a time. <clears throat> From Kansas City, Kansas, red hot chilies is number one ingredient. All right, are you ready? <laughs> this is like a one bite. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's a big bite. Yeah, it is. All right, if you could have one do-over in your life, what would you do differently? He has sweat under his eyes. <laughs> um, oh. Um. <laughs> do over here. Um, this. <laughs> Ooh. Um. I should have gotten the music to play in the background. You should have. Oh um, gosh, that probably is not good. Do overs. I, I'd like to try, like, as much as they said not to. It, but it's one of those do-overs that changes so much is like maybe trying to swim mm. at UPS or something like that. Yeah. But that's one of those like do-overs that changes a lot. Mm-hmm. Right. Then we wouldn't that be in your not, life. That does not... <laughs> watch your eyes. It does not taste good. No. Well, because you have so many in here. Thank you. <sighs> All right, you ready for number nine? Wait, number nine is <sighs> Eye of the Scorpion. This is the Hot Ones one, bless you. <sighs> yeah, I didn't know Eye of the Scorpion was a Hot Ones. From Brooklyn, Scorpion Peppers. <laughs> okay, number nine is what's something you say you'll do but never will? <laughs> oh my. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm not sure I understand. Okay, so what's something that you say like, like, oh, I'll go to Japan, but you know that you just never will? I think that's a good one. Because unless work takes me to Japan, I don't know when... <laughs> oh, when I'd ever make it to Japan. <laughs> Parker and I, maybe Parker and I go to Japan. Maybe I could go. Maybe. 
Yeah. Well, because mom and Riley don't always like large crowds, and Japan is a lot of large crowds. Uncle Cody wants to go to Disney in Tokyo. Ooh, that'd be fun. Tokyo? Tokyo! Go to, go to Disneyland with Uncle Cody? Yeah. Yeah? Oh, ha, ha. Whew, that one is... <laughs> it has flavor. Um... But just melts your tongue. Whew. Oh. <laughs> it just gets worse as you breathe. Yeah. There you yeah. Go. <laughs> Do you need more milk? <laughs> Do you want some ice to do ice lipstick? You don't drink too much milk because then you'll do what I did. I just puked a bunch of milk. Oh, well, that sounds like you. Yeah. <clears throat> oh. I got <laughs> last one's last one, so. Do you need more milk? Whew. Oh, the last dab. Mm, yep. <sighs> <laughs> Whew. What is dab doing? It's so hot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we can smell it. <laughs> and then, then we can get you a chicken wing, and you could do all ten of them on one wing. No, I'm not. I'm not. Uh, <laughs> uh, who was it? Paul Rudd. Yeah. Breathing dragon breath. <laughs> okay. One little drop. Oh gosh. Okay, what's. <laughs> Who is that? All right, number 10 is what is your philosophy in life? <clears throat> <laughs> Eyes. Oh, you can <laughs> you can only regret the things you don't do. <clears throat> yeah, because usually that's whenever you ask anybody if they have any any regrets, it's usually the things they didn't do, not the things they did do. Who? <laughs> do you want more milk? That one. <clears throat> That, the Apollo, so we got one of our friends, Jeff, he, we got him the sure knows, Jeff. last dab triple X. Uh -huh. And this is last dab Apollo. Yeah. And I feel like the last dab Apollo, and it may be because of the gauntlet, <laughs> isn't as raw spicy. It just has more like pepper flavor to it. Yeah. I think, yeah, once you get past the last dab, your mouth is just scorched. I would say... Or past the double The first five you can eat. Yeah. The last five are just... Well, Tears of the Sun's not bad. The last four are just for this. Just, yeah. All right, ten chicken wings up, ten chicken <laughs> wings down. <laughs> Look in this camera, this camera, this camera. <laughs> Tell the people what you have going on. I have spicy poos tomorrow. That's what's going on. <clears throat> <Whew. sighs> <sighs> ah! I try to keep it off my lips as much as possible, which is fine, except for it's on the back side of the lip. So like the front side of the lip is fine. It's just uh, back there. Oh, I'm gonna 